So I don't understand these kind of things, but I, but I do know what I feel. And when I go into these places of meditation, I have tremendous energy that starts flowing through me. And just recently, about a month ago, I started sending this energy to a friend of mine who's been an alcoholic for 30 years. And within two weeks, I said nothing about it, you know, because I don't know what I believe, right? And within two weeks, he called me and he said, you know, he said, I don't know what's happened. He said, but I had something go off in my brain. And he said, and I can't drink or smoke anymore. He said, I don't know what it is. And, he, and I swear to God, this man is a changed person. Now, I don't know, it's not about me, right? But I do believe that we absolutely have this ability to send our energy when we're clear and we know what we're there for and it's about giving this. And the reason I did the healing today is because I've had physical issues, but I want to learn to receive. Because when I'm giving, I'm in control, but when I'm receiving, I have to let go and just be vulnerable and experience and, and, and just let myself be loved. And I've had a really hard time with that. And for whatever reasons, and I know why. why. And I just, in the med I just went through this healing here today in Amelia Island and the feeling was so beautiful. And when you can send that to another human and then you see and you feel and there's no attachment. This guy is a changed man, right? And it's been a month now and he hasn't touched anything. And I swear he's becoming a philosopher. He's, he's come from being an alcoholic to a philosopher and it's happened just like that. It's all about letting go. And, you know, in the process of letting go, that's when all the good stuff shows up. So whether it worked or it didn't work, I felt it. And that is enough. We're all here to heal each other. But you have to love yourself first. You know, that's the bottom line. And the more that I learn to accept and love myself and receive, it's just, I just want to be a giver. But, you know, success without a, a purpose, it's not success, it's with no fulfillment, right? So the more I can experience that connection, the more that fills me up and the more I just want to do that, you know, and just be that person, be that man. And Dr. Joe says it's not about right now and what you're doing, it's who you're becoming. And I, I totally agree, 100%.